back, everybody, to what should be the final episode of Hellpoint. I spent some time off camera grinding levels for myself and for my weapon. And I should have started this video from the embassy, but sorry about that. Uh, I upped the weapon three or four times, maybe. I think it's plus 11 right now. I don't know what the cap is, but I think it's pretty cool you can do that. But I think an upgrade for it right now is like 70,000 Axions. So I don't have that kind of cash on me. As you can see, I found a dapper top hat. And it's incredible. So, there's that. And I think I put a level or two in health or stamina for myself. So hopefully we can take out the sentient and the prodigal spawn. We'll need our space soon. camera stabs at the sentient, at the prodigal spawn. I found better success, maybe, in killing the spawn first, just because he goes down in about 30%, 25% of the health bar, because they have a combined health bar, as you know. So, we'll try that. Hopefully we don't get hit by too much of the magic from the sentient. He's a jerk. I'll tell you that much. Let's just say. Go there, person. Yeah, we're going, thanks. Oh, they're pointing out uh, that the architect is right here. Apparently. Because that's where he was when we found him. And if you don't talk to the architect, he doesn't be over there. He doesn't make this portal. And you beat the game after you beat the interface. But that's not the true ending. And here at Northern Gaming, we get the true ending every time. I'll tell you that. And that includes the prodigal spawn. You have to complete his quest to get him in this fight. Read that on the wiki, even though I think it's a tougher fight because of it, obviously, but I'll just have to deal with that. Alright. Bot in. Well, not the heal bot. There is an actual the auto heal Omni Cube. That's not what we're using. Alright. I can't talk during this fight, so sorry about that. Okay, he refuses to drop a shield. Uh, gotta watch out for that purple attack. It's very, very challenging. Watch out for that purple attack, too. Alright, we're already suffering a lot. Nope. We hit the wrong cube. And I think magic hit me that I couldn't see. Against the sentient and the prodigal spawn. Stamina is still an issue, but I mean, we're gonna try. Oh, walk into that one. Alright, we're gonna. Oh, 
that's not good. I hate those purple sparks. Well, that's a quick loss. When he decides to do the purple lines like that. Alright, here we go. Another fight versus the sentient and the prodigal spawn. Schmeckeldorfed on that one. Let's, uh, whoops. We have the healing Omni Cube that can regenerate some health for us, which is great. Close to dead, I know that much. There we go. One hit in, he's down. From when I said he was close. That's how it works. Alright, we still got energy. It's regenerating our health. Let's run in and try to take this thing out. Hopefully, he doesn't run away too quickly. Oh, he's doing the purple. He can one shot us. That'll be sucky. Oh! Almost the move did it. Gonna use a full heal. Alright, he teleports, that's fine. We're doing great. Not Alright, we're doing great. Let's try to run up to him. We're trying to earn another heal by hitting him. Teleported after two hits. That sucks. All right. Really rolling around this one. Oh, a three hitter. We, we dodged them all. Let's save some stamina. Go over. All right, he's casting spells. Get some swings in. possible, ladies and germs. Most of the other magic cube ones don't do that much. The purple one does a lot. Alright, he's getting low. He's getting scared, I think. Let's take our time, regen our stamina. Alright, we're taking a hit there either way. Oh no. Oh, four in a row. I guess he does more the more desperate he gets. Considering using a heal, but I won't, and I'll pray instead. He's real low. He teleported. I'm gonna use him. Okay. Where is he? Alright, I'm getting hit by just about everything in his arsenal. Okay, 
one more full stamina bar of attacks, we might have him. And of course, he teleports away. Dodge these. He's not doing anything until he does. I don't want purple line attack, please. Different purple line. Okay, we're in the we're in the clear. Let's do this. There we go. Even if I die here, I'll always be back. There's nothing you can do to stop this. You're wrong. Except welcome death. You're dead to me, sentient. We got two achievements. Shattered Mirror, which I believe is for killing the spawn. And The Sentient, which I believe is for killing the sentient. Let's see what happens. Alright, this is the part of the true final ending, where you kill the prodigal spawn. Or he dies. That We already killed him. Okay, I thought it would have bigger implications. But he just laid down like he was tired. Thank you for playing Cradle Games. There you have it, folks. We accidentally stumbled into the challenging true final ending with the sentient and the prodigal spawn. I would like some music in the background, but there is none. So when I see music director in this list, I will criticize them. No offense. Overall, I enjoyed the game. I got salty near the end, but who doesn't in a Souls-like game? Uh, music director, Mikolai Haloko? Where's the credit music? You're being criticized. Alright. I want to appreciate and thank everybody for watching this playthrough adding a like or dislike to the videos and commenting with questions and helpful tips because there was equal parts that as well I know there's a boss I didn't find but I might do another playthrough not for YouTube no offense but maybe on my own time less stressful uh, I'll give the game a 9 out of 10 and it's got the right uh, price point it's on Steam I don't know if I ever told you that go check it out it's getting some patches throughout the recent week of release. I'm sure it'll be kept up, and I don't know about new content. That'd be very interesting to see. Uh, I leave you with my own devised credit section. And I want to thank everyone for watching. And I want to thank Tim Clark for being a stellar YouTube partner who's a good coach uh, for the Father Al fight. Unrelated. That's Sekiro. That was earlier today. Alright. Tiny Build for publishing. Thank you. Alex Nichiporchik. Thank you for the CEO. And we can't forget Luke Burtis the coup. I'm just buying some time. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Check out our Mortal Shell series. Coming soon. Releases on the 18th. We're going to have a video that day. Or three videos that day. I can't be sure. And if you want us to play through any other certain games, let me know in the comments below. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks for being you. Let's press skip and see if there's anything interesting. I think you just get reborn in the pond. No offense to the other creditors. Yeah, you just get reborn in the pond. Or you get put out of a portal in your Eva suit. Yeah, it's definitely different from the other star, but it's obviously the same kind of star. Let's see what this says. Well, it appears it's just us now. You should accept the redundancy of these so called parallel universes, too. It's much easier that way. Perhaps you will develop inner similar to mine over time. I will try to be good company. We're born here for all, just like me. It's only natural that we should live here. Don't worry, nobody will no ever know your secret. That sounds familiar. Did he say that in the beginning of the beginning, anyway? This is your realm now. Farewell.
and it went to difficulty level two. You see that under the clock right there? Achievement unlocked to the fringe. Interesting. All right. Well, like I said, pretty fun game. I liked it a lot. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys on the other side.